First night, minus three outside and no heating. <laughs> Let's see if we're gonna survive. We've, uh, we've got the uh, heating mat which is set on three, which I'm gonna put on one for the night and see if we can sleep like this because the battery is running out pretty much quick. We've got 85% and two more days of driving so and uh, it's not charging well for the uh, 12 volt, volt socket car after i don't know four hours did not charge not even one percent so we'll see good morning that's our window <laughs> After six six hours of sleeping, we managed not to freeze. No heating whatsoever. As everything is switched off, the blanket was off. And uh, yes, last night, three o'clock local time, we went to bed. And we survived. Let's see if it's still frozen outside. It's nice and fresh in the van. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's see where we are. Oh, it's still frozen. And look, the windows is not misted or anything. Lovely, very nice, very nice, very nice. I'm loving it. I'll show you the one outside. So I'll show you that uh, we have not used electricity or not much. How much is it? 87%. When we went sleep was yeah, was 86. I don't know how this happened. So we've got more electricity. Good morning. <laughs> there is no Windows here, it's all insulated. Our window is only the fan. And it's so warm. <laughs> Under the bed. Ooh. Inside the bed. <laughs> so, yeah, look, all the windows is not foggy or anything. Nothing. Zero, 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 zero. Unbelievable. This is the first night. First night. Look, outside everything is frozen. Let's see how the van looks from outside. <laughs> and see where we are ah, we are in France and yeah the van this is how the van looks like so you can't really tell that someone is sleeping there <laughs> there you are everything is open lovely you can't see inside Apart from that the van after six hours on the in the frost is not did not freeze out. Look, look at the car next to it. <laughs> Unbelievable. I don't know how this has happened, but that's what I was aiming for and that's what happened. And look. That's a proper working van, not a sleeping van. And there you have it. No, oh, that's great, great, great. Nice and fresh and driving towards the sun in the middle of the winter. Nice, nice, nice. 
uh, I forgot to mention that what I did with the fan was um, it was just open so basically the blades did not move it was just open so what we can do now is I think press that and we'll close yes was not pulling out in or out it was just open and was perfectly fine in these freezing conditions <laughs> Getting closer and closer to the sun. The village in France. One of these villages that we going through as we don't want to pay for the toll roads. the village in France Bridge, bridge from Cambodia. <laughs> uh -huh, Nobody is coming. Ah, I see someone coming. It's a little bit squeezy in here. And that's the views. Houses in the cliffs.
place to mail D947 signs for Shinan Khan. Beautiful place to visit, especially in the summertime. In 400 meters at the roundabout, continue straight onto Rue des Abbesses D947. Six, degree, six degrees now, so I think we're getting closer and closer to the sun. Sun is on Spain. Was minus two this morning. Now it's plus six. That's what's happened when you drive towards the sun. <laughs> Nine degrees already. The sun is going down. But the temperature is going up. And we're still pushing forward. Twelve and a half. The day gets longer and warmer. That's the beauty of your house when you've got the wheels. <laughs> A kind of roads you have to get through if you don't want to pay the tow charges in France. It's like a cycling lane. And then we're gonna drive along next to it, next to the uh, motorway. But not actually on it. So. That's the motorway on the front. Just gonna drive along. Continue for seven kilometers. Yes, for seven kilometers. quite bad in France if you don't want to pay but on another hand you can see really nice villages nice places which you would never see if you go on the motorway and you're saving around I don't know 100 120 euros for a trip which will take you I don't know, three hours longer so 120 euros for three hours with nice views I think is worth doing uh, that's why I'm doing this every time I go this way great fun but it's a long day we're gonna get to Spain there is toll charges as well but uh, if you avoid them there is no issue whatsoever it's really nice roads it's 
like on the motorway all the time. There's nothing like French roads. And there it is on the right hand side you can see the entry or exit for the payments and then we're gonna join the same motorway very soon again so really we just going around a bit minus three this morning plus 16 this evening that's how you do it <laughs> driving in to the lovely weather at night 16 at night 16 what's the difference how nice Bananas. But 
died here. Now going into the river bed. That's it. There is no water. Luckily, it's supposed to rain today. Oh my goodness. And that's it. That crossing is done. On another side. If you're wondering where we're going, we're going to a paradise. And this is the way, our final, final, maybe I don't know, maybe one more kilometer. less than a mile and our destination will be there if you know where we are please comment I can tell you, uh, I can give you a clue that a lot of cherry moya grows here. And that's where we are, in the heart of cherry moya spot. to do somewhere I think on the left hopefully there will be something there I think that's where this car is Nelly home. I mean, 
in we are in home. <laughs> Still driving at home. Thank you very much for watching.